What's up everybody, it's your boy Meme here. You may notice that I look really white right now. And uh, before I record my video, I right click on video capture device in OBS and I click on properties and that just like, that just fixes it. So uh, yeah, I just think that's interesting. That's some behind the scenes. Uh, now I always used to close my blinds before I started recording my video, but then I was like, oh wait, it's just an exposure issue. I know what exposure is, I can turn that on the setting. And uh, it doesn't save, but all I have to do is just go into the, go to the properties of the camera and it just automatically switches. There's like a, like a hoop of, of hair that's going through. Well, I, okay. Uh, for breakfast, I had, there's no bread because we're going to Las Vegas in like two days. Uh, and we, we, we're not gonna buy bread that we're, is gonna expire while we're gone. And uh, so I had some toast made out of like, like hamburger buns. So th those were actually pretty good. I, I, I appreciate, I, I think the shape of hamburger buns is better for toast than toast, like bread. Uh, unless it's like fancy like French bread or something. Uh, and for lunch, I had a, the mess sandwich. And for dinner, uh, you know, my dad, he got this big bump taken out of his back. It's like an assist or something. And uh, where he was getting his staples taken out. And uh, TMI, I'm sorry. He was getting his staples taken out. And uh, we went to Panda Express. Because, uh, you know, Panda Express is good. And now I'm really, really, really full. Uh, you know, I went to work today. Uh, here's, a, here's a fun little work story. Um, you know, in, in times like these, I, uh, now Shane Dawson is very, very cringe, right? But, uh, I remember, God, seeing this clip of one of his videos from, like, 2011. Uh, and surprisingly, he wasn't doing anything racist, which, which is pretty out of character for him. But he was talking about how, um, he got fired from his job for talking about his job in his YouTube videos. And, uh, I'm sure it's way more different now. It was 2011, YouTube was, like, like, six years old then, right? But, um, you know, I'm sure it's way different now, and I don't think I'd get fired for talking about my job, but I'm not, I'm worried. If someone from my, from my work finds out, uh, finds out that I do this, you know, and they say I'll have to quit, or, like, stop doing this YouTube, I'd probably quit. I gotta keep doing this YouTube thing. It's so important. It's so wildly important to me. I gotta. Um, but, anyway, I hope I don't get fired for, for talking about this. I won't, I'm sure, but I just think it's interesting. Like, who, who's gonna get fired for talking about crazy customers? Uh, anyway, the guy walked in. No, this guy didn't walk on. This guy called on the phone. And uh, I think he ordered something like a, like, I don't know, like, let's, let's say like a turkey sandwich and like a turkey bean club, right? Those are way too similar. Turkey sandwich and roast beef. I forgot the sandwiches he ordered. Those are just examples. So um, he's like, yeah, I'd like a turkey sandwich and I'd like a, like a roast beef. And we worked out all the toppings. And he's like, oh, could I get jalapenos on the turkey? I was like, okay, jalapenos on the turkey. He's like, no jalapenos on the roast beef. And I was like, okay, so jalapenos on the roast beef? He was like, no, jalapeno, he was like, no, jalapenos on the turkey. I was like, what? Uh, and uh, I said something like, so jalapenos on both or something like that. And uh, then he just got like, he, he started like mumbling something about like the jalapenos. He was like, rrr, rrr, uh, jalapenos, rrr. and the, the signal wasn't great. I wasn't, I didn't have any idea what he was saying, right? And um, I was just kind of silent for like six seconds because I, I, I was trying my hardest to just figure out what this guy was saying. Because, you know, you, you don't want to have a bad experience on the phone because, you know, people people will associate that with the company, not not just the person working there. And then they'll never go to the sandwich, no, the, the, the sandwich shop again, right? Uh, but, yeah, so this guy, I was silent. And he was like, hello, is anyone there? Hello. And uh, I was like, I'm sorry, one second. So I got my, my coworker. I was like, this guy's really mad. I have no idea what's going on. Uh, so I handed the phone to him. He figured it out. Apparently he was asking if the jalapenos, if they costed extra money uh, to, to go onto the sandwich. So that's what he was asking. I, I had no idea. Um, oh, someone is here to, to water our plants while we're gone. Um, but, you know, it was just so weird. He was asking if the jalapenos costed money, which I don't know. This, this personally makes sense to me. Of course they don't. But uh, I don't know why he's asking. He got really mad. Uh, he showed up. He's wearing a Seahawks shirt. You know, average Seahawks fan. I'm kidding. I'm a Seahawks fan. Um, but, um, yeah. And he tipped me a dollar. So uh, he obviously must have not been too mad if he tipped me a dollar. Or maybe he was just making up for it, being so mean. Uh, but, yeah, I don't know. Right. Yeah. See you, dude. By the way, a dollar... Okay, for, the, for context, a dollar is that much, not that much to tip. Uh, you know, if I was a customer, I'd probably tip a dollar. But um, a lot of people tip, like, four dollars or like on a larger order sometimes even like ten dollars uh i've gone tip ten dollars like ten times like the three months i've worked there but some people tip ten dollars and it's insane i'm like why'd you why'd you ever tip ten dollars um you know i'm not complaining but you know it's just odd 
Uh, but yeah, okay. That's a five minute long video. That's crazy. It's been a while. Uh, yeah. All right. See you, dude.